president will tell you she's a Baptist. Oh. Really? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right. Yeah, exactly. You know, so it doesn't mean anything. It's where do you stand on the book? Where do you stand on doctrine? Where do you stand on salvation? You know, you've got to be careful. Man, a man will use names. You know, uh, supposedly she was raised, you know, uh, as a Baptist by her mother. Uh, I've known a lot of those kinds of Baptists. Uh, you know, and they're anything but born again Christians. Uh, so, anyways, we'll stop there. With that, are there any questions? Any comments at all? Uh, the Congregationalists and Methodists, those are two groups that, even though they technically started in England, you're going to find their, their strength, uh, their heyday, if you will, is here uh, in the American colonies, the British colonies, and in, in, in a young United States of America. Uh, but they are, again, those two groups, they are going to be Protestant offshoots. They, they, they come from that Reformation period, and even though they both get much closer to doctrinal truth than even their parent groups, uh, in some ways, you know, they've never really parted from those things, and uh, as has happened with pretty much every uh, Reformation group, they've apostatized back almost to being uh, you know, if, if nothing else, they're certainly uh, in, back in bed with, with the Church of Rome, you know, and their doctrines have certainly uh, apostatized incredibly. Uh, very rare to find, I mean, there, there are a few, you know, uh, you know, like I think of Ian Paisley who passed away a few years ago, uh, the uh, independent Presbyterian uh, preacher from uh, Belfast, you know, in Ireland, you know, I mean, fiery preacher, uh, still five-point Calvinist, but, uh, I mean, powerful preacher uh, in that, you know, uh, but became very politically involved as well, you know. Uh, I think the strongest thing I can give to him is the fact that he was so incredibly anti-Catholic, <laughs> he got beat up a few times for it. All right, so if no questions or anything, we'll go ahead and we'll stop there for this morning and we'll take some.